Ladies and ladies around the world, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Yes, we are back, and this time around, we are tackling the Asmantis Genshin event. Wine tastes the um, same as I remember. We seen in um, but where the last video who share on YouTube, memory. and um, yeah, after that, we're going to tackle the Jean Yun's story quest. I have unlocked, as I said before, the uh, event story quest related to, to her specifically. And we're going to do this today. And yeah, last time, last time, I mean, in the last couple of videos that I, that you saw, on, you saw on YouTube, I tackled the first three parts for the other, the uh, coaching event, which was so interesting and so funny at the same time uh, because we always had a trio Boats but a trio of so many different and interesting characters and those that come um, across hanging around tend to I mean, stay a while so it siblings, is where many things come to settle so Lini, Nat and Fremine and the fact that Linet didn't want to eat any spicy food because I remember. Um, her stomach cannot, could not take it anymore. Who share the memory? And uh, <laughs> after that, we had Dory, Layla, and Madame Farozan, and this was so funny as well because <laughs> Dory didn't want didn't want to pay too much more uh, regarding the cost of the meal, but it came back to bite her in the end because she <laughs> actually spent thirty k more. For the dish we prepared with the help of Smiley Yan Zhao. And yeah, and the last the last group that we had was Ito, um, Uchishinobu, and Ayato. Where do you <laughs> want to go next? If you'd like we to were see so the tourist spot, trying to I have a few get every single bite uh, of tofu in our in our belly, with the help of, of course, Ayato and Rishinobu and Paimon, obviously, to make sure that Ito would not eat a single bite of tofu, but, uh, yeah. Ayato was the, the, <laughs> yeah, Ayato was the real, the real one on, on this one, because he understood the situation and acted for, Boats are made for transferring well, commodities back and forth. Let's say for uh, and those the best related to, to Ito. So it and, is where um, many things come to settle. Yeah, I can't wait to see what's uh, I mean what the last part of this Christian event is going to bring to the table. Uh, and Samantha's also, wine tastes the same we as have, I remember. as I said before, Jean in Story Quest. But where are those and in who this share Story Quest memory. specifically, we're going to understand why Shuyu, which we well, encountered in the Lantern Rite Festival, how did she came about? What's her story? I want to learn more about that, and I know that I'm going to learn about it this stream slash video. So, Where do you if you're excited and you are hyped for if the content like growing up on YouTube, spots, then I I have a few make references. sure to leave a like on the video, hit that subscribe button, and activate the notifications bell notification bell so that you never miss a video from me in the future also go over on the socials x twitter as well as instagram um and um dm me over there and uh have a chat also uh comment down below your thoughts regarding this video as well as any other questions or any yeah, thoughts that you Every may have regarding the Twitching event. Did you like Don't it? Run. Did you not like it? Was it too fast? Was it too low? Um, and what about John Yoon's story quest? What did you like about this specific story quest? And what um, did it give you in terms of hindsight regarding to her mama, mama bird? Especially so. Yeah. Uh, all of this. And yeah. If you want to... Well, see me playing the game in a raw and unedited fashion, and well, be the first to see this live. And you know what to do. Where do you I'm want over to at twitch.tv forward slash forever. You'd like to see you're going to get spots. Well, I have a few this, references, but 
without the editing process and the fact that it's going to be slightly delayed on YouTube. You can have the best of both worlds. And yeah, and that, I guess that um, this is all I wanted to, to relay to you guys. So I suppose that without further ado, I'll jump right in with you all. See what these events have to offer. Let's go. Right. Wine well, the same let's as I talk remember. to a uh, smiley but where are those who share the memory? It's, it's funny because um, <laughs> I was supposed to wait until 6 to 8 a.m. in the morning. And the fact that I talked to you guys actually made the... Um, actually made the um <laughs> actually Boats made, made for the time go back and forth. perfectly so and that those that come across Leo tend actually to um, so it is where trigger many come to without me uh, doing any jump in the future <laughs> that's amazing but yeah let's go uh, let's talk to Mali Yanjiao let's see going to be the last group of parents we're going to encounter today. Excited. Alright. Go. Hey, Yanjiao. So, uh, do we have any more orders for today? Last day today. Here's hoping we get through it without incident. Uh, why does Paimon feel like you just jinxed us mm. again? <laughs> the day passes without an incident. Uh, that's great. <sighs> we made it all the way to the evening. It ended up being a pretty smooth day after all. Maybe it's because we've gotten so experienced at running this whole thing. We've come a long way since our first day on the job, haven't we? Hmm. Back then, we were struggling to remember who ordered what. But everything's a piece of cake now. Yeah, but, um... Hey, don't get ahead of yourself. Yeah, but who would come by this late in the evening? Uh, actually, now that Paimon thinks of it, Lenny and his siblings came around about this time the first day, didn't they? Wow, um... <laughs> Ember, Eula, and... What's his name? Mika. I don't even know what when's the last time we've seen Mika. When when was it even? Uh, I think was it that was it at the one in Lesser Fest, or was it even prior to that? Eula? Eula and Amber? Yeah, I think I think Eula and Amber was at the Wine Lizard Fest. But I'm not too sure about that. Oh. Traveler? 
Paimon? Fancy seeing you two here. Amber? And you are Nika too! Are you here for dinner? Why so late in the day? <laughs> we just finished an escort mission yeah. for a merchant caravan. The original plan was to make do with some rations for this evening and continue our trek north towards Stonegate. But Captain Yula brought up the fact mm -hmm. that none of us have eaten Liyue cuisine for quite some time. We thought we might as well swing by the inn and see if we can still order something. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, so this is Yula's treat, huh? <clears throat> We've been eating the same rations for the entire trip, so I simply thought it was high time we had ourselves a proper meal. Do you have a problem with that? Well, um, <clears throat> what if, um, what if I say, um, well, welcome to Wanshu. Can I take your order? Good question. What should we get? Hmm? Wait a sec. Why are you taking our order? The traveler's been filling in for the chef here. You came at just the right time. You'll be the last customers to enjoy her cooking before the original yep. chef takes back the rings. Yep. Wow, really? Good thing Eula suggested we come here. I wouldn't want to miss this. <laughs> so, what shall we get? Hmm, I'm not as familiar with Liyue cuisine as I used to be. Mika, Eula, what are you in the mood for? Anything goes. I'm just looking forward to trying the honorary knight's cooking for myself. I'm sure it'll be a great learning opportunity for me. Hmm, something small, I suppose. We have to hit the road again after we eat. Beyond that, anything goes. Wasn't it your idea to come here, though? Yeesh, this is like getting blood from a stone. Alright, guess it's up to you, Amber. You name it, we'll cook it. Huh? Then I guess... Eh, I don't really mind either. Anything goes. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Oh, so they are all just, um, sitting here. Hey, look at the doge here. Dodgy. Anyways, um, let's see. Mika. I'm sorry. I really can't think of anything off the top of my head. I mean, I could pick from the menu at random, but I'd feel more... Okay. Oh, one thing. I know I said I don't mind what we have, but no alcohol, please. Yeah. Neither of them can uh, drink. No alcohol. It's a real is, um... Uh, I've still got some sparkling water here. Yeah, that's it. Just that's the spirit, Micha. That's the spirit, Micha. No alcohol. Just, just water. Bottling water. We have a lot here in Liyue. Great. Micha, Yula, and Amber. That's amazing. I mean, Amber and uh, and Yula. Ow. Oh. Fire and ice. Amazing combo. Anyways. Hey, uh, Yan Zhao. Um, we have an order for three persons. Uh, well, uh, they want something actually uh, pretty normal, I suppose. Anything goes, huh? Oh dear. This is a chef's worst nightmare. With no idea of your customer's palates, you're left to make a wild guess. Still, now that you've worked in the kitchen for so many days, I have faith that you'll be able to figure it out. Yeah, I mean, Go just, uh, you have some Show faith in us. Got. That's great. Let me think. What do they like? What could they be trading? Sticky honey roast. What about, how about that? Sticky honey roast. 
Uh, that would be great. Or a sweet madame. Or, I don't know. Pile them up. <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Oh, so that's the, <laughs> the that's the, the name of the dish. Anything goes. All right, Joe. Judging from the look on your face, you've already figured it out. All right then, go ahead and show them what you've mm -hmm. got. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, uh, Zhongli, make sure you're prepared. Uh, even though it's supposed to be ether, but whatever. Get started. All right, so um, let me grab my um, my uh, my piece of paper here, so that I can see what's on the menu. All right, let me see. So anything goes. Says that you're in the note that we have to get am bamboo shoot egg egg school mm, flower and the uh, snapdragon. All right. Uh, let's see. What does it say? What does it say? Let's see. Um, it says here. A simple dish filled with rich flavors, straight from the watch, made from stir-fried ham, bird eggs, rice, and all manner of other ingredients. They say that the myriad recipes for fried rice have resulted in it being considered the first choice for those who don't know what to eat at the moment. Uh, of note is the fact that this simple dish is, in truth, quite the comprehensive test of a, ch of a chef's capability. Okay. Only skill and will, say, will get you a dish that brings back memories. Oh. So yeah. Okay. Um, so that was the sheet of paper. Um, for the specific, um that is specific anything goes dish so uh, let's try to cook it let's try and cook it let me cook let's see how and let's see how that goes of a mop oh, i like the animation here all right so first we have to um prep ham bamboo shoots and snapdragon so let's get to do that Um, ham first. So two slices. One, two. All right. Bamboo shoots. Need the uh, six, or maybe six bamboo shoots. Slice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then, snap dragons. We have eight of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I diced them all, and now let's move on to the next step of this cooking. Mm. So the second step that we have to do, guys, is prepare the bird eggs and snapdragon. Mix the eggs. Yeah, we're Golden Ramsay here. <clears throat> Let's, uh, chef it up. Hey. Okay. Okay. Really? Okay. There you go. Ah. This part is always strong, so it's difficult for me to handle, but... Anyways. Now. Last touch. 
before we finish this anything goes ish. That is to add the ingredients. Put anything goes dish. Yep. Alright. One. And two. I'm not going to change anything. Finish plating. Alright. That's it. Mmm, this is delicious. Perfectly seasoned. And even the rice is bursting with oh. flavor. Nothing like a piping hot meal served straight from the stove. I've missed this. <laughs> You've put the finest Pavonian field rations <laughs> to shame, and that's no mean feat. So tell us, traveler, what's this one called? Um, so it's this good. one's called Anything Goes. Um, Pinot's guessing we can't just call it Anything Goes, right? Well, yeah. Hell Paimon doesn't know how to explain this dish at all. It's got no name. It's just basic ingredients simply cooked. Basic ingredients <laughs> simply cooked? Really? I could have sworn that you put something fancy in here or gave it some kind of chef's yeah, magic in, touch. Uh, this isn't the finest dish in the world, but it's the one you need right now. Okay, you've lost Paimon. What do you mean? Well, because Paimon doesn't understand, I'm going to clarify. You've been on the road for a long time, and you've only been eating field rations the entire time. So you mean, we only think this is delicious because we're so hungry? Yeah, that's, mm, that's right. There's Got to be more. Perhaps the fact that the aroma of freshly cooked hot food is a welcome change from cold pre prepared rations. <laughs> yeah, oh, that too. Kind of like the feeling of waking up to the smell of freshly baked bread in the morning? Huh, that makes sense. Yeah, it's almost like we're back at Good Hunter again. Uh. But good hunters in Mondstadt. <laughs> Why make a point of trying lyric cuisine if you can't even taste the difference? Oh, I'm not talking about the taste. I just meant the feeling of comfort, you know? It's like the feeling of coming home. Comfort. Coming home. Yeah, comfort coming home. Well, Yan Xiao did say we want to make our guests feel right at home. Well, you do know that what makes for um, what makes for a tasty tasty dish is highly subjective. Everyone's got their own preferences, but a chef caters to all comers. We ourselves in their shoes, and that and that's a chef's passion, putting smiles on customers. True that. So, in other words, the secret ingredient is passion? Despite how terribly cliche yeah. that sounds, I'll admit that it holds true for this meal. <laughs> well played. Mark my words, <laughs> I'll remember this recipe. Okay, but you can't really have a recipe without a name, though, right? Have we <laughs> she likes it. For this dish yet? Um, well, what about you gave me some ideas? Do you have any? Hmm. How about right at home? 
Hmm. Right at home. Nice. I'll make sure to put that in my sticky note. Uh, Yula. I mean, I'm going to sit next to you, girl. <clears throat> hey, Yula. The rations we brought were adapted for my signature moon pies. To come up with something even tastier. I gotta hand it to you. You did a great job. Still, please do drop by and try a few Stormcrest pies next time you're in town. I insist. Sure. Stormcrest pies? Obviously. I'm going to love it. Rinse you? Yeah. Mark my words. I'll get to eat those. Alright, Mika? It's so long, Mika. Where have you been at this time? I mean, I know you've been with uh, the Rich Richardson's team, but... Hey, how have you been faring? Is going alright for you? I know, it's been a long time since uh, I just voice actor. I mean, actually had to voice some lines for Mika, so... Back when I was on the expedition with the Grand Master, I was often put in charge of cooking. Grand Master Varga? Ooh! Uh, they're, teasing us, they're teasing us with the this Grand Master Varga. <laughs> so he was often put in charge of cooking when they were on the expedition. Under the circumstances, I could only cook some pretty crude meals, but everyone still enjoyed them a lot. Maybe passion mm. was the secret ingredient then too. Passion. Yeah, passion is rightly, I mean, definitely, the secret ingredient to them all. If you put any, if you put any kind of effort and passion to what you're doing, then it's going to taste or look amazing. So, um, Ember, it's been, um, also been a half minute, well, as you lot, by the way, but, uh, yeah, how are you faring? Hmm. And what are you thinking about, Ember? Ember? Yo, Ember. Earth to Ember. <laughs> Listen to me, Ember. Listen! Oh. Zoned out just now. Didn't see you coming. That's something on your mind? Yeah, I mean, it seems like it. Yeah, that food you cooked for us just now? It reminded me of the meals my grandfather used to make oh, for me. Ah, our grandfather. I thought I'd forgotten how they tasted, but it all came rushing back. Yeah. Memories. He used to make Liyue dishes all the time. I'd do my outrider training with him until the evening. Then wait patiently at the dinner table. Wow. So sweet. I'd sit there with the smell of delicious food wafting in from the kitchen, waiting for him to finally emerge with the goods. Sometimes we'd have Eula around for dinner, and even though she'd always find something to complain about, I could tell she really enjoyed the food. Ah, uh, so... Oh. Maybe she remembers it too? And, they, and maybe that's why she suggested you come here for dinner. <laughs> Your words, not mine. Don't ask her about it. She'll only give you another earful. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. Fine. I won't indulge any further. I know there's something between you. As well as there... As well like... There's something between you and uh, Kale, you know, I think. I don't know. Just friendship, I don't know. Alright, guys. Well, seems like uh, we've finished every protein uh, parts. It's really amazing to see them um, together. A lot of people. That's great. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Smiley Angel, uh, Baihan, how's 
There you are. Thank you for all of your hard work over the past few days. Yeah, my pleasure. Uh, assuming I'm still being paid, that is. <laughs> Straight down to brass tacks, are we? Here, take it. I've thrown in a little extra as well. Oh, thank you. Call it a bonus. bonus. Like Hard that. work is rewarded. I like here. that. Yay! It's like all the tiredness and stress have suddenly melted away. <laughs> I'm just lucky you only worked on this job for a few <laughs> days. At the rate you were progressing, a few more weeks and I think I might be made redundant. <laughs> well, I for one look forward to enjoying your coaching many more times in the future, Angel. <laughs> Anytime. Bring some friends with you next time and I'll show you all what Smiley Yunxiao can do when working with both hands intact. Great! I'll Although see about that. On the safe side, cook carefully in the meantime. You may have just jinxed it again. <laughs> right at home. The receiver of friends from afar, part four, complete. Let's go to the kitchen part and uh, try recipe if I can. Is that why? Why? Okay. Wait. So learn that recipe. So right at home. What it said. Let's see. Where is it? Some. Um, There he is. There it is. I don't have a lot of ham. I guess I'll just make one. I'll just make one. Alright. Almost. Okay, well. One has been made. That's amazing. So, Yan Zhao, um, it was really nice to work with you and enjoy um, that sweet, sweet, um, well, understanding of the cooking process, preparation, the mixing, and the finalization. We're chefing it up. Always oil, salt, vinegar. Ugh, yeah, that's all you need. Alright, well, this was the cooking event. This was amazing. Uh, like I said before, we encountered so many characters. So many characters. I wish we... I wish we could have seen more. More characters. Maybe some characters that I haven't seen in a long time. Even lot, even not. Yeah, even more. But um, yeah. I suppose that there's going to be more events um with this in the future. So, to worry about that. 